here you have to replace one of these drives in the servers and you're in the data center. I'm going to tell you how to do it step by step. As you can see, I am in the data center. So as you can see, the red lights, that means that the drive is bad. So I just took this off. I'm going to replace it with a new one in the data center. So easy job. Just remove the screws on the side, put the new one in and that's it. That is how the data centers are. They are huge. You need a badge usually. And you need to put your finger at the badge first, the finger later, and then you can access to the place. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to access anywhere. Those places are huge, as you can see. And you have to try to memorize where you were before. Otherwise, you're going to be walking for half an hour or did you find someone so hopefully this is the exit as you can see these are pictures of the place and it's huge so you have generators battery backups yeah, air conditioning system you have a little bit of everything as you can see so now still trying to find the exit as you can see, you got places to play games here as well. So, these places like Doom, <laughs> you know, you can keep walking and sometimes you keep walking in circles. Uh, it's like a nice trap. I hope you have enjoyed this video. So the idea of this video is showing you how the data centers are. So if you want to learn how to fix servers and everything, I am in US. I can send you a server, use one, new one, only for parts, uh, whatever. So when you, because the, the servers that you see, it, they are not the same like a regular computer. So if you can get some practice and know how to fix them and how to upgrade them and everything, you're going to get paid more. So in this case, for instance, for this little shop that I did, it was like 10 minutes uh, shop. I, I got uh, one dollars so it's, it's very it's very good for a, a little short um, shop. So if you want to do the same, please let me know. Also, uh, what I recommend you is if you're going to go to any company and you want to get the job, the, what I recommend you is just to get certifications. Certifications are expensive. You, you can pay for a certification just for the class, just for to taking the class. You are going to spend maybe 300, 400, 500 dollars, like just like nothing, just for the basic certification. There are uh, certification that cost more, like maybe 1,000, 2,000. Uh, those are high-end <laughs> certifications. So what I, I recommend you is go to my playlist in my YouTube channel. You go, you can go where it says uh, how to become a computer technician. Go watch all my videos if you want to see the premium classes you can go to my website gabaqsa.com and then you can buy the classes that you're not going to see here on my youtube channel and that, that way you can get your certification like i said uh, before if you get the certification you're going to get uh, the job that you want because most most people they they don't have any certification so if you are applying for a job and you have 10 people in front of you and none of them have a certification but you do uh, you're going to get the job because you know uh, you can have a lot of experience but you don't know if the other guys really know everything or just they know something uh, not everything so if you want to make sure that uh, you know everything is is better if you go through the certification even if you think that are easy stuff or even if you have a lot of experience and you have been working on this maybe go through the basic because when you once you want to get the certification and you take the exam maybe they will ask you something that you didn't know so it's better to be safe than sorry so also i am in us so if you want a server please let me know i can send you a server to any any part of the world so that way you can practice and you can get better jobs and earn more so hopefully this video was useful if you have any comment leave me a, a comment in the section below and see you next class